Alrighty, alrighty, alrighty. Hey, how's it going, everybody? It's your truly the Trick or Trey here from the Good Old Killer Instinct Squad. Today we're playing some more of that Walking Dead, yeah, on the walking season dead. one. So sit back, relax, enjoy the show. I know who you Let's are. Let's do this. Oh, I In got another road. good one for you. Ooh. You've been all by yourself through this. Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug. You got it, boss. <laughs> Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. We kick his ass. <laughs> That's what I'm thinking. <laughs> God. There's no way I to don't save give a both. shit about what happens to you, but if anything happens to my daughter or that little girl you've got with you, <laughs> you watch your ass. This game series adapts to the choices you make. The story is tailored by how you play. Alright, let's see where we're at now. Uh, just a little elka bong on the head. Damn it. What'd they get this time? Uh, looks like a rabbit. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. Yes, it is. <sighs> I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was gonna take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. We'll manage. We'll manage. Maybe. You know, some people aren't too happy about the way Lily's handling rations. Lily knows it's important to keep the adults fed and functioning. Sometimes that means someone's got to miss a meal. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time, things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. I'm gonna say Kenny won't abandon Kenny us. Won't abandon us. He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him, though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal, anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. I'm gonna say... He's just looking out for his daughter. Looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. Hey, Mida, how's it going? Thanks for stopping by. And didn't he punch you Happy in the Sunday face to you too. Uh, knock me flat. Do a quick shout out. There we go. Shoot it. Take the shot. We need anything we can get at this point. Now, how did you miss that? Shit, was that Kenny? I don't know. Come on. Uh oh. I think we accidentally shot somebody. No, no problem. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> 
Pin yourself to the bear trap. Jesus Christ. Oh, shit. No, no. Please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off. God damn it. Get, get it off me. Travis, maybe they can help. These might be the same well, guys that raided can. our camp, and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the so fuck who raided is there your a camp? bear trap out here? Who raided your camp? I, I don't know. Guys with guns. Please, we won't bother you, I swear. Lee, this is fucked up. We've got to help. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. I'm gonna say we'll try. Gotta get him out of there. Oh God, thank you. Fine, but you gotta hurry. Hurry, please, hurry. Uh oh. Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Oh yeah, so he's super folks. Oh no. Oh, I take that back. He's ultra fucked. Then he is. Never leave. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers off of me. Shoot the leg or get the trap. Let's try to get Please, the trap. Do stop. something like this. Stop, stop, stop. I appreciate that so much. Much get thanks. Me out of this. Oh man, oh man. Oh, we're gonna chop his leg off. Much appreciation. No, no, no! Try let's the trap! Go, let's go! Anything, please! Yeah, we're gonna chop you up, buddy. Ah! Ah! Lee, it has to be now! No problem. Ah! No problem at all. Damn it, Lee, just cut off his fucking leg! That's what I'm trying to do, chop off his leg. I'm sorry, but we have to go, now! There we go. You only need one to live anyway. Oh God. Shit. Is he... He passed out. I probably could have got him out that Brandon, trap, but hey, go. I ain't got time to sit here all day. Behind you! Travis! Come on, come on, uh -oh. we gotta move! Well, you better run. Well, he's dead. No! Oh, we pull his guts out. It's gotta be a horrible way to die. All right, episode two: Star for Hill. I can't stand that dude right there. Have a great stream. Thank you, I will. First chance I get to kill that dude, he's dead. He's low key a racist. Okay, who's in the bushes? Probably us. Get the gates open! We've got wounded! Shit! What the hell are they doing? Come on, come oh on! Oh my god! What happened? Oh, what the hell? What's going on? Don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee! But he passed out from that pain. What the hell? You can't off. just be bringing you people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? No, I don't. I thought we could I save his life. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every well, struggling survivor we want. come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang on. 
We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. <sighs> Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and mm, see sour what I drew. Wait, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This isn't your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. Everything always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not gonna be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around, but now that it's running out, suddenly I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Those people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're gonna have to Trying decide to whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. I don't Dad, think she has please. that. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Maybe that's still smash low key. <laughs> Just kidding. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food, but nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. Oh, damn. Why, why the black man gotta do everything? Oh, I gotta make a hard decision. Who gets to eat and who doesn't? Why don't you give it to Doc? I'm a little busy with your mess right now. Okay, fuck okay. you too, rude bitch. I don't know. Can you give me a hand real quick? Say sure, what do you need? Sure. What do you need? Just apply some pressure here while I try to close this up. You know, I thought I was starting to get used to this, sewing up people's injuries. But I mean, cuts and bruises are one thing, but Lee, this man has no leg. So I did the right I thing. I did the right thing. Yeah, I know you did. The right thing is just scary sometimes, I guess. Well, you've done all you can, Lee. Thanks for the help. Go ahead and check in on the others. I need a little space here anyway. Alrighty. See who else I can check up on. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Do you really need it? Do you really need it? My dad gave it to me for my birthday. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. So now I gotta look for a hat. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Want something to eat? Give half an apple. I'm gonna say eggs back in a bit. I can still talk to her though, right? X button. I'm giving out food, what should I do? Lily has me handing out the food. Ugh, that can't be an easy job. It's not. I won't be able to feed everyone. What should I do? Well, if you wanted to get in good with Lily, I'd make sure Larry gets some food, even though that guy can be a real dick sometimes. On the other hand, giving that food to Kenny and his family might make him remember you Larry if anything. he decides to take off in that RV one day. What about you? You need food, too. We all need food. I can't tell you what to do, but whatever happens, I know you'll be trying to do the right thing. Thanks, Carly. 
sleeping, sleeping any, better? any better? I'll go no. with that option. I know we should be grateful for beds, but no, I'm not. Drugstore? Yeah. Back in a bit. We go talk to him over here real quick. Word's getting out that you want to leave the motor in. That ain't no secret, Lee. It's probably our best bet. Look, you've been good to me and my family. You saved Duck from those monsters, and you stood up to Larry at the drugstore. I won't forget that. You and Clem are welcome to come with us. The coast does sound like a smart coast idea. does sound like a smart idea. Maybe that is the best thing. I know that it is. I'm taking my family. Want something to eat? We'll give him a piece of Here, jerky. Kenny, take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy's taken care of. How you, doing? How you doing, Doc? I'm okay. Me and Clementine are coloring. Guess what it is? I don't know. A dog? Nope. Oh, I know. It's a goat, right? No. Pretty brave kid. They were pretty brave when we brought those people in here. That's because I know Mom can fix him. Hey, Doc. How about a little food? Give a piece of jerky. Here. Yeah. Oh man, I'm so hungry. All right, now I go talk to him again. Thanks for buying me time to get we'll that go guy this out of the bear trap back there. I can't believe you cut off his leg. I don't know if I could have done it. I didn't have a choice. It was that or the walkers? Lily has a point about these new people being extra mouths to feed. I know, but maybe the problem isn't that there isn't any food. There just isn't any here. We got to think about moving on. Yeah. Want something to eat? We have crackers and cheese. Here, Kenny. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Yeah, I gave him something. Sure, then hand it over. I'm starved. Thanks. Shot the Clementine again. Here, Clem. You need something to eat. Get half an apple. I love apples. Thank you. Are there more? No, honey. That was the last one. Oh, um. Enjoy it. You deserve it. There's one piece of food left. Uh, I'm gonna save the last piece of, of food for someone else. Longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Let me talk to him. Hey, is my friend gonna make it? I don't know, but Kaja will do her best. I promise. I can't believe you chopped off his leg. There was no other way. So who are you people? Our group's gonna want to know. I'm yeah, let's get some info I'm from him. He's got two first names, Mr. like Parker, Logan Paul, Jake Paul. director at my school. We all came down from Stone Mountain for the playoffs when, when everything happened. How you holding hey, up? How you holding up? Uh, well, I, uh, I keep wondering if I could have done something to help. You know, some kind of, I don't know, something. He'll be prepared next time. He'll be prepared next time. Next time? Yeah. Relax. We'll get your friend back to normal in no time. I sure hope so. And I gotta give some food to my boy. It keeps the walkers out. Carly's been doing the bulk of the lookout duty. Hey, Dark Link. Thanks for stopping by. Will you by. hold the damn board steady? 
I'm How's trying. Your day going? I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Oh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. Hey. You, you holding up a okay, out? I was pretty fucked up back there. Having to cut that guy's leg off. Yeah. I just hope Kadja can save him. Lily's pretty pissed at us. Listen, I know her intentions are good, but... Yeah, but Larry nothing. does. She's making the smart choice. Those parasites you guys brought back need to go. You ever miss the Air Force Base? I mean, this wall isn't exactly military standard. No way I'm going back there. You saw what it was like when you guys picked me up. Completely overrun. Want some Here, food? eat something. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. He just says we need, you need our help. My help. Uh, I'm giving it to Mark. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. That may be you the only clip you have. me the axe? Come on, Larry. Cut Lee some slack. He knows you're just out to protect Lily. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clementine. He... Oh, I just need some food. Going this long without a proper meal make anybody cranky. I wasn't giving Larry shit to eat. Not such an easy job, is it? It's okay. I know you're still watching out for me. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength well, to do this a new every clue. day. I don't have a choice. Hey, thanks for looking out for me and my family. I'm serious about that offer to come with us. You've more than earned a ride on the RV with me. Still, I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none, none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah? Well, I don't see you working on that wall. Screw Larry. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... We'll say let him go. Let him go, Kaja. But... He just needs time. It's been a rough morning. That man you brought, I tried, but he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh, 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 I did not see that coming. Take this. Move, move! Shit, it's stuck! Back, back, back off me. Back of his head, gone. You okay? Yeah, thanks. Why'd you bring him here in the first place, asshole? Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. We're all infected. We're all infected? Everyone? I... I guess so. I don't know. I... 
All I know is that I've seen people turn who I know were never bitten. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God... Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. I'm going to say, are you armed? Are you armed? Yeah, F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out, see if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what are y'all thinking? Okay, we'll go to the dairy. You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to hey, your dairy. Nick, how's it In exchange, going? Thanks for you give by. us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Well, you tuned in before, before you head out. Gallons should power Cook one of our from generators. Our was recovering from surgery. Oh, so this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. And with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. Hey, thanks for that, darling. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Kenny keeps us motivated. Kenny keeps us motivated. He believes in hope and knows how important it is for us not to give that up. I can't fault him for that. Or maybe you just don't want to be in charge. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? I'm gonna say Larry knows. Larry knows. Great. That can't be easy. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore. Yeah, I'm using Twitch Guru. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the Senator? No, it's not now the time. not the time. Well, I'm here whenever you want to talk. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years, I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, I really appreciate that. Might I mean, be some more in the God settings. I'll check it out. He did. Right, Lee? I need to yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about That's yourself, Lee? Where are you from? So I grew up in Macon. I grew up in Macon. Right here in the heart of Georgia. That's what I like to hear. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? I'm gonna say Kenny. I'm gonna say it's a democracy. We work as a group. All of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? I'm gonna say change the well, subject. Well, the kid here's our newest arrival, but we're all looking forward to some food. We really need it. Well, here's to helping each other out. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. That's a set up. Mom's been running the dairy for well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's. You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always oh, pulling this shit. Bandits. Who? Those look like the people who oh, raided man, my camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. Really and you guys were keeping it up. There's only two of them. Oh no, there's Yeah, and you know what? More. We ate it all. What are you gonna fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens, but let's just wait this out. I hope they move on. Fuck you! Damn. Fuck you! Fuck you! 
Jesus. Talk about the overkill. Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on, let's get to the dairy where it's safe. Who can use that crossbow? Yeah, for real, Mecca. Free cars, boat. Here it is. St. John Family Dairy. <laughs> Y'all can see how we kept this place so safe. The fence keeps them out? <laughs> you betcha. They fry like bugs in a zapper. We're pushing 4,000 volts through that thing with generators and amps. I'm going to assume that's a lot. This is a brilliant setup. This is a really brilliant setup. Suits us just fine. This place looks untouched. You never know the rest of the world is in ruins. It's worth protecting, hence all the juice. I thought I saw y'all with company coming down the drive. Gosh, this is our mama. I'm Brenda St. John, and welcome to the St. John Dairy. This here's Lee. He's from Macon. A couple of our old farm hands were from Macon. They grow them good there. They got a few more friends staying at the old motel. Oh my goodness, that place is pretty vulnerable. Have you got someone with survival experience to lead you? Oh, add time. Kenny's working on somewhere, somewhere, safer. somewhere safer. He doesn't think the motor end will stay safe forever. Sounds like a smart man. Hold on, I, I thought you said someone else was running things. Oh yeah, I, I thought she was asking about survival tactics. Well, it don't matter. You're here now. We'll make sure you're safe and comfortable. We brought gasoline. Thanks for having us. We brought some gasoline on good faith. We're all incredibly hungry. These are for y'all. Baked fresh this morning. Amazing. Can't get stuff like that anymore. Not without a cow for milk and butter, that's for sure. That's right. Hopefully Maybelle will make it through this bout of whatever she's got and be with us for a good long while. Your cow is sick? What's she... We have a vet. We could bring her here. We can help you folks out. A vet? Oh my! Our prayers have been answered! Maybe our whole group could come. For the day. Well, how about this? Y'all go get your veterinary friend and I'll prepare some dinner. A Sounds big like a good feast deal. for all you hungry souls. It'll be nice to have some folks to help out around here again. Danny, why don't you come help me out in the kitchen? Why don't I head back with the food and round up everyone for the trip over here? Might want to take someone with you. Remember, those roads can be dangerous. I can handle myself. Take this. Why don't you go ahead and take Ben along anyway? Take care of yourself, Lee. See you in a while. Oh, All right, back to the motel. Why don't you take a look around? Once you get settled in, I could use some help securing the perimeter. Is there a problem? Sometimes the dead get tangled up in the fence before they fry and end up knocking over a post. It'd be a big help if you could walk the perimeter. You can learn a little something about our fence. I'm gonna go top off the generators before they run dry. Come get me when you're ready. You it bet. Tops me off this until place I run is dry. incredible. Yeah. It's got food. And that fence? Oh man, that fence. If we play our cards right, this might turn out to be a place we can stay. So how do you want to play this? Let's say... Let's make sure the place is safe. Before we can think about bringing our whole group here to stay, we need to figure out if this place is as safe as they're telling us. Right. Obviously they think it's safe. But is it safe enough for the kids? I noticed a broken swing over there. Not a big deal, but... Maybe there's other things not working that we just can't see yet. And checking the fence perimeter? Sounds like a decent way to get a good look at their defenses. Alright, I'll keep my eyes open, and you find out what you can from Andy. Take a look at that fence over here. I mean, a swing. Too bad it's broken. I'll bet Clementine and Duck would have loved something like this to play on. Kids used to like that old swing even more than the tour sometimes. <laughs> I'll bet. How long has this been used? 
Oh, I'm say mind if I try to fix it up. Mind if I fix it? Sure, that'd be great. Mama sure does appreciate y'all helping out. Looks like it just needs a new board for the seat and some rope. Make it safe for Clem and Duck. And let the St. John's know we can pull our weight around here. Or else I gotta find a board. Anything else around here? Yep. Mmm, fresh herbs. I can hardly wait for dinner. Hi there, Lee. What can I do for you, sweetie? Can I help you with anything around the house? I think with Danny's help, I've got things pretty well squared away in the kitchen. But feel free to check with Andy. He's got a lot of weight on his shoulders these days, so I'm sure he'd love any help he can get. Will do. Well, if anything comes up, then you need to ask her a bunch of questions. Let me know. Well, Lee, I sure appreciate it. <coughs> no Damn, excuse me. So what have you found out? Is this looking like a good place to stay? I'll keep looking around. All right, keep me posted. There's a board right there I can use for a swing. This is too big right now, but if I can find something to cut it down to size, this might make a good seat for the swing. There we go. Mind if I use one of these boards? Already making some repairs, huh? I like a guy who takes some initiative. Yeah, go right ahead. He just shoves a board up his ass. Like the fence runs around the entire property, not just the house. Yep, can't take any chances when it comes to safety. Hi. Hi. Well, I'm glad you guys decided to help us out. I noticed back at the motel that you folks are pretty well armed been stockpiling, huh? We can help protect the dairy. Yeah, if you need some extra people to protect the dairy, you can count on us. Well, hopefully it'll hey, never come Hey, Super Thrill Gaming, thanks, thanks for stopping by. How's your day going today? We can't be the first people you've invited up to the dairy. Well, no, we've made similar deals with other folks, uh, trading for gas and food, but ultimately they moved on, looking for the people they lost contact with. Let's go Mark fix the perimeter together. The perimeter now. Oh, good. The fence will stop a walk for about three or four seconds, but it's overloaded if we leave the husks out there. You know, Mark and I can clear the fence ourselves if you want to stay here and finish up with the generators. On your way to work. Well, that's what's up. Make great. that money. I'll turn off the northwest section, and uh, if you guys could strip them off and look for any weak points, well, that'd be a big help. Sounds easy enough. Stay attentive. You never know. So how's the place looking? Is it safe enough for us to stay? If we can? It's pretty amazing what they've done with this dairy, but let's see what it takes to secure this fence before drawing any conclusions. I can't wait until everyone's out here. Everyone besides Larry. He wouldn't be such a pain in the ass if you weren't telling him we were talking behind his back all the time. I... I'm... I'm sorry, alright? He's a piece of shit. That guy's a piece of shit anyway. 
Relax. You're not making things any better riling them up. There's one. Ugh. Yeah, I say he's fried. Lee, it's dead. Come on, let's push it off. Andy said when this fence is working, the walkers go up like a tree branch on a power line. If those lights are out, that means the fence is off, right? It better be. Looks like he's stuck. Looks like he's stuck. Disgusting. Come on. Yeah, he's he definitely still did. a few more. Once this fence is patched up, this place will be a fortress. Yes, they are. Super Can you imagine addictive. not having to worry about the walkers anymore? A fortress need people to these people to defend the fortress it. Needs option. people to defend it. We've got enough people. So what's your take on the brothers? They seem to have this place tied down pretty well. What do you mean? What do you mean by that? I don't know. They seem decent enough. I just want you to know that I've got your back if anything goes down. That's all. Thanks. There's another one. I see it. Oh, took a hand off. Huh. You never get used to the off. smell, do you? <laughs> nope. Christ. I can't stop thinking about dinner. Thanks for the rations earlier. It's not easy eating in front of the kids, but it's all that's keeping me on my feet right now. Focus on Let's the task. Let's try to focus on the task. They knew what they were doing, teasing us with food and then giving us chores. Uh, having a good meal will be worth it. Come on, I think I see where they're getting in. This one must have knocked it over trying to get through. He's tangled up in there pretty good. Come on, help me get this thing back in place so we can get Mr. Crispy off of here. I think we'd get better leverage from the other side. Good idea. <clears throat> If you're waiting for that guy to help, it ain't gonna happen. Come on. <laughs> Little help here, Lee? We'll go with this option right here. There we go. Holy fuck! What just happened? The fences are on. Why the hell would he turn the fence on? He knows we're out here. Ah! 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 What the? Get to the gate! Oh, shit. Get down! You asshole! Jesus! We had an agreement! Now you're fucked! Who the fuck is that? No idea! Fuck! Now what? With a fence on that gate, it's our only way out! You got lucky that time! I see you! Get closer! Anything over here? The blades are stuck in the dirt. You you fuck with that? Come on out. Let's see if we can try and move this thing now. I'll fuck you, dumb bitches up. Well, you're. You assholes. You ain't got money to do with what we want. Come on. If we can reach the gate, we can get through this fence and back to the house. Ah! They're on the Shit! Move. I can do it. What about all the uh, Yeah, Dark Hawk, I feel you. It's got the big do for now. Now there you are, boy! 
What happened? Oh, shit. It's one of the dead we pushed down earlier. I'm gonna have to move it. Catching up to me. Yes. Let's get out of here. Oh, you know what's gonna happen? The dude talking to Mad. Shit. Sure. There's a goddamn, a goddamn ambush. ambush out there. Holy shit, are, are you okay? Bandits here? On our property? Oh my lord, what happened to you, sweetheart? It was those bastards in the woods, mama. Yeah, I'll be alright once it's out. God damn, it hurts. Hey, y'all. Mark, oh my god, what happened? He got shot with an arrow. Christ, are you gonna be okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I should just... Pull it out. Oh no, honey. Come on. Brenda's got you. Come on inside now. We'll have you all sorted out. Well, you must be the best. What kind of shit is this? Polo to Pity. Thanks for stopping by. The way up here. Bandits, I guess. I think it was them that attacked us. They gave us a lot of problems in the beginning. Day, Killed going. a bunch of our farmhand. We were able to get them to stop by making a deal. What you do about these people? Food for protection. Not like we had much of a choice, but they did stop hassling us. God damn it. Carly said this place was locked down tight. Maybe it isn't as safe well, as yeah, for real, super We're thug. sorry. We, we never had them screw with us like this. Not since we started giving them food. Listen, we may have had an agreement with those people, but we will not stand for this shit. Ain't no way we're gonna let those sons of bitches get away with this. You know where these assholes are? They're hard to pin down, but I think I know where at least one of their camps are. When you're ready to go scope out that bandit camp, come find us. Bandits? Are you serious? This place isn't safe. We can't stay here. Not safe? This place is a hell of a lot safer than that motor inn. I think all of us and our guns can handle a couple of punks with bows and arrows. Yeah, that's all they got is bows and arrows. We need to find a way to get our whole group out here to stay. Take this place over if we have to. Whoa, cool your jets there, Rambo. These are nice people. Let's not do anything to get us thrown out before we eat. I'm gonna head out and help Dan deal with these bandits. You guys should try to make friends with Andy and Brenda while I'm gone. Well, that's easy. I got charm coming out of my ass. Yeah, that's real charming, Dad. Where's Ben and Carly? Since Carly and Ben ate some of the food on the way to get us, she volunteered to stay behind and watch the motor in until we get back. She's gonna be mad when we don't come back. <laughs> Hey, uh, I remember seeing kids in your group, so I went ahead and fixed that swing while you were out. I hope your kids like swings. A swing? I love swings, just like at my treehouse. Come on, Doc. Why don't you kids go and play on the swing, huh? Yeah. Thanks. Anytime. We're looking out for you. Lots of options to choose from. They're storing gasoline all over the property. Probably them bandits. I already scoped out that bandit camp. Looks like a feeding station for the cow.
Holy, oh my god, I'm so glad you two didn't get killed out there. Do you think Mark will be okay? Wish I knew, but I think he's in good hands now. Yeah? It's not too bad? He'll be fine. I've seen guys go through worse. How could you all bring us to this place? Say, so how do you feel about leaving the motor in? How do you feel about leaving the motor in? It's a welcome change of scenery. I don't know. If we'd just stayed where we were, then Mark wouldn't have ended up with an arrow in his shoulder. I take it you and Kenny didn't exactly make up on the way here. I tried seeing things from his point of view, having a wife and kid and everything. But gambling with your family's life is pretty stupid, if you ask me. Yeah, a little key is. Hey, thanks for backing me up this morning at the motel. I know I came down on you guys pretty hard, but you do agree with the way I'm running things, right? Kenny believes there's still hope. Kenny believes there's still hope. Maybe that's what we need right now. Well, hope doesn't do any good if we're all dead. I'm focused on keeping us alive. And not giving my dad food. That was cold. Oh, uh, fuck you, dad. I can't stand Larry for nothing. If there's not enough room, first right chance I get, us, he I out. Guess a few of us could camp out here in shifts. Lots of hay. Hmm. Enough of these might work as adequate cover for arrows, if that becomes a problem. Okay, let's see who else I can talk to. Let me check a look at this generator. That thing keeps a fence electrified. I guess Mark and I were lucky we weren't touching this thing when it came on. Ooh, I'm ready to go scope out that bandit camp. Oh, let me check on them over here. They look happy. Talk hey, to Clint, real quick. Do you like the swing? Fun. Be sure to tell Andy thank you, okay? I will. Will you push me on it? Sure. sure. Happy to push you on this way. Mind if Clementine takes a turn? All right, Duck. Let Clementine have a try for a bit. Okay. Send their ass in the orbit. One mean push. What do you what think, do you of, think the of the dare? It's pretty. It reminds me of how things used to look before. Yeah, it does. Do you think things will ever get back to how they were? I'm not I'm sure. Not sure, Clem. I hope so. I hope so, too. But we're, we're safe here. We're safe here now. As long as the bad people don't get me, too, right? I won't let what happened to Mark happen to you. Promise? I promise. How you holding up, Clementine? I'm okay, I guess. Are you okay? Yeah. I'm just a little worried about Mark. Is Mark going to be okay? Got lucky out there. Could have been a lot worse. <sighs> Are you going to find the people who hurt Mark? Then we have to make sure they don't hurt anyone else. Be careful. I want you to stay lucky, too. Ever since I met you, I've had good luck, so don't worry. Okay. All right, Clem. That's enough for now. Okay. Thanks for pushing me. Of course. It's all yours. Yeah! Okay, Duck, don't pop a gasket. Ugh. I think I gotta talk to him. Hey. Haley, found anything interesting? I'm just trying to make sure this place is secure. In case we decide to make this a more long-term solution. Except for those people in the woods. Seems pretty safe. Good to know. Keep your ears open for anything else that might help us. Your family made it here, Did okay? Duck and Katja get here, okay? 
Well, it wasn't easy. Duck didn't look so good on the walk over to this place. Well, if everything works out, maybe he and Kancha can have an easier life here. I hope you're right. Duck and Clementine deserve a better life than starving to death at some crappy motel. But how are you holding up? How are you holding up? I hope they feed us, Lee. Soon. On the way over here, I was getting dizzy. Hands shaking, cold sweats. Thought I was gonna pass out. They've got food here. Yeah, but I'm not just talking about one meal, you know? I'm gonna go have a look gonna talk about Lily. Don't wait too long to help scope out that bandit camp. It'd be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about the St. John's and their relationship with those bandits or whatever. Right. I'll see what I can find out. Fellas. How you feeling, Lee? Look, Why this guy looks like R. Kelly is beyond me. Out there. Uh, we should have told you how dangerous it was. No shit. You saw what they did to your buddy. Nobody's safe here until we start to fight back. But how? The two of us should go out and do some recon. Then we'll all mount up for some revenge. Hell yeah. Who the fuck are these people in the woods? They actually look more like 50 don't know. I think some of them used to work at the big box up the way. Save lots. Yeah. Anyway, they're nutty as all hell and get mad when they're hungry. So, are you ready to head out there and find their camp? Say, so let's go. Yeah, it'll be a good opportunity to find out a bit more about what we're up against. Let's do it. I'll stay here and hold down the fort. Remember, we're just doing reconnaissance for now. No use getting ourselves killed. I probably shouldn't have drunk that beer. Now? I'm getting sleepy. Yeah. I'll be back soon, Clementine. Please be lucky. I will. About to get me an energy drink or something. See anything? Not yet. I I they lose too much here. progress. It's gotta be close. Found it. Seven viewers in chat, appreciate you for standing by. What happened was a power flicked. We just gotta do this little part again. See anybody? Almost that looks empty. Looks empty. Watch my back, Lee. I'm gonna check out the tan. Too small. It can't be their main base. That's what I was thinking. Take a look around anyway. There's probably some shit around here they stole from us. But Mr. Darklink has a Super Bowl party to go to at five, so that gives him 21 minutes. Mm. Looks like they're enjoying the party stuff. Let's search these boxes real quick. What's in the boxes? They're all from save lots. The first few days they told folks to gather to the save lots by the interstate. Anything worth taking? Well, unless you need empty cans. Well, unless you need a bunch of empty cans. <laughs> I'll pass. Boxes from the dairy here. Probably the food we've been giving them. 
fuckers cross the line. Nothing but fumes. Shit. Just water. Nothing. Empty. It's like a remote with a button on it. What do you find? A video camera. Let me see that. Battery's dead, though. Oh, good. What else they got over here? Let's see if we can find anything useful and then get a move on. I see you handled that gun I lent you pretty well. You a hunter? No, but Lily keeps us all on a regular training schedule. Lily, huh? Sounds like she's running this democracy of yours. Yeah, you can say that. Looks like they expected to be here a while. Take a look at that picture. Your guns down. I ain't going back. You tell him Jolene ain't going back. Hey, we had a deal. No shooting as long as we gave you food. What the fuck happened? You had a deal with them. I ain't them. Oh, I know you. I know what you are. And I know what you do. You don't know me. Steal my shit. Steal everything from me. We're looking for the people who attacked the dairy and shot my friend. I don't know where they are. But they ain't here. So get the fuck out of my camp. She's lying, Lee. Now maybe you didn't hear me last time. When I asked you, sweet, put your damn guns down. You think I won't kill you? I'm gonna take this here crossbow and put a nice sharp arrow right through your eyeball. And into your goddamn brain. You're not men. You're, You're monsters. Number. All men are monsters. Take what they want and then destroy it all. Take a can of beans. Take a little girl. It's all the fucking same to you. Where did you get this hat? The little girl. You stole it from her. So what if I did? You stole her from me. What the hell are you talking about? You know what? I changed my mind. I'm putting this arrow right through your balls. Yeah, right through. String oh, them up on that tree. Then I'm gonna head down to that farm and shoot every goddamn Don't person I see. Look, there's two of us and one of you. No matter what happens, one of us is going to kill you. Like you could kill me. They couldn't kill me. They tried. Killing everywhere. Take all the dead folks you want. We'll make more. Go on. Tell him, boy. Tell him what you got in mind. For us. Damn. God damn it. So he thinks, I guess. Thanks. I guess. Well, you're welcome. I guess. <sighs> it's a clean shot, though. Right through the forehead. That's good shooting right there. Still, what a waste. So, that's it. We going back? If they ain't here, I don't know where they are. And it ain't a good idea to go tromping through the woods looking for them. So yeah, 
We head back. Once they see this, they'll get the message. Yeah, take that crossbow. Come on. That was a hell of a ride, huh? Jesus, Danny. What? You ain't getting soft on them, are you? Not after what they did to your friend. You're back. What happened? Handled it, Mama. They gonna see that and really gonna read this place. This isn't what Terry would have wanted. Terry? My husband. Miss him every day. Then screw it up for everybody then, why don't you? Oh, calm down, princess. I'll do it myself. What are they arguing about? What's going on with them? Don't know. Squabbling, looks like. A lot of tension with y'all, huh? They can't agree on how to run things. I'm they have different that. ideas about how we should run our group. If they don't find any common ground, this whole thing's gonna fall apart. No, it's just tough times. Everyone's hungry, and people get a little stir-crazy when their tummy's empty. And Lee, don't worry your head about them bandits. I'm sorry you've seen more violence than I'd have thought in your short time, but you all are safe here. Don't worry. Are we? Think I'll go have a look around. Don't wander too far. Dinner will be ready before you know it. And thank your friend Koch again for me. She and the kids are in the barn with the cow. That woman is a lass. Hey, Mecca, you're back. Sorry about that earlier. I had the power go out. Well, it flickered and knocked everything off. Welcome back. It's okay, Clementine. Well, I thought the power knocked out the stream. It's okay, go ahead. Whoa. Katya says Mabel could have her baby tonight. We'll see, Clementine. Well, appreciate you for staying. I know you got to leave in about two minutes. Thing? Daddy said it's called a salt lick. Yeah, but don't lick it. It's gross. Did you lick it? I don't know. Give her a head back. My hat! You found it! You knew I needed it. Well, you did tell me it was a birthday present from your dad. Listen, did you give your hat to anyone? No. Did you see any strangers around the motor inn who might have taken it? No. Why? It's probably nothing. Just let me know if you ever see anything like that. Okay, I will. Hey, Lee, do you think you'll ever have kids? Well, I haven't thought about that in a while. I don't know. I haven't thought about having kids in a long time. Well, thanks for finding my hat. You're welcome, Clem. Do you want to pet the cow with me? Nah, but you go on ahead. She looks skinny. Yes, yeah, she has. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. So how's how's the, cow? the cow? Well, better now we got Doc on the case. 
Oh yeah, I got some new merch in my store. Link in chat if y'all want to check it out. Hungry, huh? Don't worry. Mama's cooking up some good grub. We met this woman up in the woods. She seemed to know your brother. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he probably talks a little more than he ought to. Thanks. Yep. Nothing in here. That's what's up. We even got the new logo. It's at the very bottom of the store. Okay, there's nothing in here. You found it too, huh? Lee, they're hiding something behind this door. I got a quick look. They got boxes of stuff and something metal and sharp. Don't get paranoid. It's my job to be paranoid, Lee. I got my whole family on this farm right now. How about you? What about Clem? We'll protect her no matter what. I'll protect her no matter what. I know you will. Look, that guy with Katya, what's his name? He locked it up real tight the second we came in. I definitely heard a noise back there, Lee. What? My point is we gotta know for sure. So go find a hammer or something and I'll have this thing off in a second. You back me up in case them farmers come running. Hang on, man. Think this through. You smash the lock. Then what if it turns out you're wrong? You just fucked your chance to get a good meal in those kids you're trying to protect. Use your head, Kenny. All right, Professor. What'd you have in mind? Let me have a look at what we're dealing with first. Hey, Lee. You know I, I don't know. Lock, That's what right? I was thinking. No. Why would you say that? Because you're black. Well, you're... You know... Urban? Oh, <laughs> you are not saying what I think you're saying. Jesus, man, I'm from Florida. Crazy shit just comes out of my mouth sometimes. Sorry. Those hmm. game is low-key racist. They've been treating Lee like what? shit this whole time. See those screws? Instead of yeah, Mecca Urban, urban. We know we he just wanted take to say. Off the assembly, have a peek inside, and then replace it all again like nothing ever happened. All right, sounds like you got a plan. I'll hang around and keep an eye on that guy with the cow. Andy. Shit, yeah, Florida's gonna be Florida. Dead. Whatever. Can I help you boys find something? Just checking on Just the barn. checking out the barn here. Never been to a dairy farm before. Just don't roam around without me or Danny. The farm can be a dangerous place. You know, the bandits and all. Sorry about your friend. Hey, uh, do me a favor. Don't fuck around with this door, okay? Just, you know, mama gets nervous. Andrew, I need your help again. No problem. Right away, Doc. Hey, guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. Ugh. We're the final way to distract Andy. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. You got a screwdriver? For what? Uh, uh, never mind. Danny mentioned he needed something. Did he say what? Shit, I, I can't remember now. Sorry. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. We'll see you now. Okay. Let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Shit. Looks like a bunch of old dirty clothes. Ooh. Smells pretty foul. Maybe there's something in one of these f these stalls.
It's a feeding trough. Just some fence posts. Nothing else in here. Don't say that. Distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. What about those generators? I was just thinking that the generator. So, how does a woman like yourself run yes, this whole sir. place? Oh, I managed had the to power go out on me. Plus, I had my boys to help out. I couldn't do it without them. All right, let's go tamper with the generator. gonna regret doing that appreciate that Mecca I mean uh Damn, dark this link thing is the worst piece of shit something's always tripping the breaker a toolbox Yeah, I saw that. Kind of makes me wonder what's going on. I'm just gonna borrow this for a second. Okay, I got some tools. Yeah, trying to get another control. Maybe I can talk to the people up there. We'll uh we'll finish talking later. You've been getting along with Larry. <laughs> He's just a big old sweetheart. Right, Darkly, ain't he? thanks for stopping by, uh, Martin. Don't know if I would have used those words exactly. Don't judge. Hopefully, honey. I get my this income taxes. This world is bringing out the worst in They people. said mid-February. Look, this is mid-February. Lots of humanity every now and then. So, what are y'all keeping the barn back there? Besides cows, I mean. You should try the borderlands well, tilt. I might just do that. Curious, aren't they? I don't mean to pry. It's nothing interesting, I can promise you that much. Just some odds and ends. Takes a lot to run a farm, you know. Let's see how's Mark doing in there? How's Mark doing in there? Best patient I ever had. Oh, my boys get so much as a scratch and start hollering. He can definitely teach them a thing or two about being tough. I'd still like to check on him. You're gonna have to trust me on this, Lee. I've helped stitch my share of wounds. I know what I'm talking about. We ran into some trouble out there. Oh, I'm super just funny. Glad you two Why just had to play that after this? Just don't know when to quit. But my boys, they can hold their own. You say we met a woman at the Before camp. Before she died, we met a woman out there at her camp. She wasn't one of those bandits. Sounded like they did something pretty bad to her. And your marauders are still out there. a bitch. <laughs> I think all them folks out in the woods had drug problems. What does that have to do with anything? Yeah, she didn't seem like she was on drugs. Any of them. I think I'll go have a look around. Kind of peaceful out here, ain't it? Enjoy it while you can. You'll probably start hearing those monsters frying against the fence before too long. 
Look, I'm gonna head back in the farm, see what I can do now that I got the tool. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. I'm gonna say Danny needs something again. Danny needs something again. <sighs> all right, all right. Be right back, Doc. Okay, let's do this. False alarm. I'm back. Damn it. up something I think could help with the lock. All right, good to hear. That'd be something one of these stalls, because I already looked everywhere. Feel free to backseat if y'all know anything. close to your mom for now. Okay. Empty. Uh, empty boxes. Hey guys, seriously, don't fuck around with that. Come on, enough already. She looks skinny. How do you like that cow, Clint? She's pretty. Have I missed anything? No, not really. It smells funny in here. I'm assuming the Watch position. It, right, Lee? Hey, don't use swear words, okay? Mm hmm. Okay. Okay, I've checked this whole farm. I've talked to everybody. That'd be something I'm missing. Lots of hay. Ugh, enough of these might work as adequate cover from arrows, if that becomes a problem. I don't think checking hay is going to solve anything. So, Larry, it uh, looks like you're getting along with Brenda pretty well. You know, for a nice change of pace, how about you try and mind in your own fucking business? Oh, okay. That's how you feel. What's going on, Lee? Did something happen? I'm gonna say something's odd with the there barn. There may be something going on with that barn. I'm telling you, Lee. The longer we stay here, the more trouble we're getting ourselves into. And what exactly do you think I'm supposed to do about it? If you want to go in there and start rooting through other people's shit, then get to it. But if yeah, it's up just to like me, damn dirty. we should just take our food and go. What were you and Kenny arguing over? What were you and Kenny arguing about when I came back from the camp? He's losing it, Lee. He comes over and starts talking about searching the barn and that these people are hiding something. But you told him to mind his own goddamn business, right? 
we are guests here, and we don't need to be overstaying our welcome more than we already are. The way I see it, we just need to skip the dinner and get our food to go. But I'm starting to think your friend over there has another agenda. Hey, uh, can I talk to you in private for a second? Okay. It's been three months. Your dad still treats me like I'm some kind of asshole. Yeah, well, don't expect that. Well, you kind of remember this part. That's just how he is. I'm gonna say, does he treat you like that too? Does he treat you like that too? Look, my dad can be an ass sometimes. I know that, but he's not a bad guy. He just—he's got a lot of pain. He's been through so much and lost pretty much everything, and it's hardened him. You know? Yeah, he's bitter and hateful, but that's all just to protect himself. And I had to me. take my shoes off. All he's got left in the world is me. And that goes both ways. So yeah, he's probably gonna keep treating you like crap, but that's just because he still has one thing left to care about. So don't judge him. And don't judge me for sticking by him. He's my dad. And I love him. After what Kenny told me, I'm starting to think they may be trying to hide something. You two are just asking for trouble. But if you insist on wandering around, I'd be careful, Lee. I'm gonna go check things out. Watch yourself, Lee. Anything else over here? Quaint. Doesn't offer much in the way of protection, though. Pretty that everyone's just sitting out in the wild, you know, uh, wide open. When homeboy Mark got shot with a whole arrow. I'm gonna do some more exploring. There's gotta be something I missed. Hello. Glad I got to use her today. My girl here. I'm gonna say, what's with the wheelbarrow? I saw a wheelbarrow over there full of garbage. Some bloody clothes. Things happen on a dairy. Cut myself dawn bad just the other day. Blood everywhere. You seem okay. I'm tough. You really like that gun. What's not to like? Not much, I guess. Exactly. Or this place with just How one do you cow. Run this place with just one cow. Used to have more. They get hungry too, or sick. Got your doctor friend here now, though. You guys must trade for a lot of fuel to keep the generators running, right? People get hungry, and a few loaves of bread fetch a high price. Y'all are luckier on this side of the deal now. I'm gonna go wait for supper then. It'll be a good one. Okay, I'll talk to him. Can I talk to her again? Pardon me, Brenda. What's on your mind, Lee? When will dinner be ready? Should be ready before too long. Some shift gonna have people ruin it? Okay. I'll figure it out. I'm pretty sure I know what's in that barn. I just don't know what to fucking do. I've talked to everyone, did everything. I'm not looking at the fence. I don't think it has anything to do with it. Hey there, Andy. Yeah. I'm gonna say. So, where do you keep the rest of the tools? Well, if you need something, just tell me what it is, and I can get it for you. Eh, not that important. I might as well just ask an obvious question. Why do you lock that door? Because we can't afford to lose our shit to the people in the woods. Uh, they come down here every once in a while, raid our stuff, even with the fence. Alrighty then. I tried distracting Andy, but he keeps coming back. 
There's got to be something out there you can mess with to keep him busy for a while. I'm gonna try that generator again. That's the only thing I can think of is just screw with the generator, but he keeps pushing the button. Maybe I can tamper with it? Okay, we're getting somewhere. There you go. Ow! Damn it! The thing is moving fast. Ow! Damn it! The thing is moving fast. Looks like that belt's driving the uh whatchamacallit. That'll do it. There, that should do it. Fucking Danny, where do you find this piece of shit? Oh, fucking thing through a belt. Damn it, dog. Oh, son of a fuck. Oh, this take forever. There we go. I can fuck with this thing. I should probably talk to him first. No. What I think? Probably the dad. Mom, Dad, dinner time! It's dinner time! Okay, honey, let's get that. Dad! Dad! Come on! Let's eat! Kenny, come along, honey. Kenny, come on. Don't make the children wait. I'll make an excuse for you. Get that thing off. All right, I see who's behind door number one. Cannibals, Boy, I bet. Didn't you hear the bell? Dinner time. What the, what hell, the hell you got in that back room? Look, we have food here, but Danny and I still got to do a lot of hunting to keep everyone fed. When we catch something in the woods, we skin it and dress it back there. Mama doesn't like us to make a mess in the house. So you see, nothing to worry about. Oh, Brenda, you are wow. an angel. I thought they killed We had to block the back door after a walker got upstairs. Don't worry. That was a while ago, and ain't been back inside since. Everybody sit down. I'll go get the meal. Oh, this is a delight. I could eat a horse. Where's Mark? Now, don't you worry about him. I've already brought some food up. You just let him rest. Mind if I wash my hands first? Bathroom's right outside in the hall. And be sure to get under your nails. You've been mucking around in the dirt all day. <coughs> Good. 
gauze pads. I could use a shave. Some kind of lotion. I can't select the sink. I'm just gonna leave that shit open. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. We'll check on Mark. If he's still alive. Some first aid recently. Musty as hell. Huh. Yeah, what is this stuff? Looks like a bunch of medical waste in here. IV tubes, saline. What would dairy farmers need with this kind of stuff? I feel they butchering that poor man. has made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. Mm. Mark is upstairs with his fucking legs cut off. You're eating him. That's what crazy. The hell? You're scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. Go upstairs and look. You'll find a guy with both of his legs hacked off. This is a dairy, not a ranch. Think about it. It's true. Everything could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We got to think about living. Settle down, honey. Oh, Growing shit. up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? to continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better. I'm say just let us oh, go. I'm gonna puke. Just let us go. Andy is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, Kenny, get, get your gun. gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere. We got lots of use for y'all right here. What the fuck? 
the fucking black Put fuck. your guns down. We're walking don't out of here. Near my fucking Mommy, family. I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I everything eat? Everything will be okay. Everyone, everything will be okay. <gasps> Lee? Lee? <gasps> oh, hell no. Let's Let go of her, you son of a bitch! Did God damn it! If you hadn't dragged your feet! Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. Yeah, bro. Is there a way out? Yeah! Through this fucking door! If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches! They locked us in here. I think it's a meat locker. Those psychos have caught you in dark! Open up! You sons of bitches! Dad, please stop! This goddamn film sucker was the one who brought us here! Will you all just shut the fuck up? I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. You're, you're worse than the walkers. Dad, please. Okay. Let's Come calm on, this dude down. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah. I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill them! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? Refused to give me my day's rations back at the motor lodge. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. Bro, well, now's not the time I for guess this Guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. Dad! I'm not your enemy, Larry. I don't believe you. Don't forget. I know who you really are. We settled down! Your dad's not making things any easier for us. Open the fucking dad, door! Dad, stop! God damn it! Come on, try us out. Coward. They got caught you and duck, Lee. Those fuckers have my family. I know. We're gonna get out of here and find them. Yes, we are. There's Marvelous on the way. Let us out Let me now. talk to her real quick. Don't give up. Gonna We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. They're not gonna open the door! You, you think a fucking apocalypse <laughs> gives you the right Don't to wanna know what people kind. into meat? Dad, Could there be a hole behind these healthy. pallets? Red bastards. No such luck. Oh! I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, 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 Easy! Uh, oh god. Dad? Not this again. <gasps> no! Dad, come on! Dad! Oh god, he stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! We're gonna be stuck here with the water. He's not dead. It has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel. How fast he turned. What are you saying, Lily? I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're gonna be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you. We can bring him back, Lee. Yeah, I saw you put him down. But right now, we have to keep him from coming back. No. God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead! Maybe you're right. right. No, god damn it! My dad survived worse than this! 
Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on, we know this guy's not gonna make it. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee. I need you. Please help me. Come on, Dad. Come on. I'm staying Wake with up. my boy. You're right, Kitty. Let's get you this over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see. I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! That's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! <laughs> No, 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 no! Go on. Let go of me! No, please! He not dead? Well, he about to be. No! no, no, no. God help us. You dead now. I said the first chance I get, he's out of here. I Don't know. you fucking touch me! <laughs> Clementine. Clem. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. He, he was dead, Clementine. But what if he wasn't? He was, I, I promise. <laughs> well, you never seen this scene? I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else, something hopeful. Uh, I'm gonna take a quick restroom break. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Like what? A safe place. Some place safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? You found a way out? I'm working on it. I'm trying to talk to her ain't gonna work. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. I'm gonna say Larry wants you to move on. Larry would have wanted. Fuck you! Oh. You think he wanted this? Of course not. You but... don't know what he wanted. You never knew him. You never gave him a chance. Maybe not. Maybe, maybe I should have tried hard. But I know he loved you. He'd want you to get out of here. Let me get that block. You have to smash a door, maybe. Get away. I just need to. I told you to get the fuck away! Okay. You, uh, you think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. It's just you and me. It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, 
She'd probably side with the St. John's against us. Yeah. Let me talk to Clementine. I know it was necessary, but I just wish Clem didn't have to witness shit like this. I worry what it's gonna do to her. Okay, time to find a way out of here. I've done everything in here. Get away. Oh, the AC. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's yeah, something cool. else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Mm-mm. Uh -uh. All right, Dark Link, thanks for that. I do truly appreciate the support. It's not coming off that way. A man said he's on the road watching the stream. It's not coming off that way. I gotta find a coin. The duck behind the air conditioner is big enough. We might have found our way out of here. Yeah? But I need something to loosen the screws. I got nothing. Shit. Hang tight. Maybe I can scrounge something. I doubt she's gonna be any help. Why can't you just leave me alone? I'm sorry. But if we're gonna get out of here, we need your help. And Larry's. I think I may have found a way out of here. But I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry... Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Oh, boy. Yeah, Larry did. Any idea which pocket he keeps us change in? You fucking vulture! A ring. My mother's. Don't worry, I'm not taking it. Here we go. Two quarters. And a dime. This is what we need. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. There we go. It's too small to fit Looks through. Looks like it'll probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it.
Say go quickly. quickly. I'm scared. You'll be fine as long as you move fast enough. <sighs> okay. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. So we can't be waiting on here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Get that weapon. Yeah, give me that. And that. No, 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 no. I just want one. Come on, give me that back. Okay. Oh, God, what's wrong with these people? Jesus, this is where you put your people. Sick bastards. All of them. Oh, even better. No, I prefer to have... I want to kill them, I don't want to tase them. What's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Yeah, they okay. did. You ready? Ain't no tasing. Yeah, let's go. Stay close. It ain't right making me stay out here all night. I didn't do nothing. They just treat me like I'm some kind of screw-up. Hey, what are you doing outside the barn? Oh, shit. Just guarding the place, like you said. You know, quit sitting out in the rain like a damn deer. Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Get one to keep and kill the rest. Can I pick which one to keep? Not the kid. Meat on the oh, I know, neighbor. This is Lee, my favorite focus. part, too. Where's Danny? When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. You see where he is now? Take him out together. We'll take him out together. How? He doesn't know we're out. He's got to walk past us to get to the meat locker. We can take him out when his back is to us. See what he's doing now. Oh! Oh, I wasn't fast enough. Shit, this 
why you killed that woman in the woods. She was about to spill everything. You weren't ready to hear yet, Lee. Had to stop her. You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Watch me. I'll keep Clement and safe. Gonna hurry up and end the stream. I know it's Super Bowl Sunday. It shouldn't be much longer. Just kill a couple people. I do appreciate everybody for stopping by. You could have been doing anything and you chose to watch me stream. That's support right there. The Super Bowl starts. Ow. Shh. Is everyone okay? We heard screams as we were coming up to the house. We'll say we need your help. We need your help. Yeah, when you guys didn't come back, I figured something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed him to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Duck and Katja in the house, and I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right, we're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. That's what's up. We will need a strap. Put the gun 
down, bitch! I know not to say that. I'm moving out like a thug. Go, Brenda. Put the gun down, bitch. Bah. Yeah, bro. That probably wasn't a bright idea. Please, please, don't you take another step. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Uh, I have to clip it myself. We won't be saying that. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Just stop. There we go. They took Doc. Where's Teddy? I said, don't move, asshole. Don't you fucking hurt him. Oh my god. Let him go, goddammit. Oh, I gotta that say, ain't gonna happen. Oh, not my boy Kenny. Andy, who the fuck do you people think you are? Look at what you've done. Come tell him shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. You think I'm playing here, boy? All we wanted was gas. We came to you peacefully. There we go. Oh no. Give me that. Oh, come on. Yeah, good idea. We'll push you in that field. Enough. 
He's had enough. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit! It's over! Fuck you! Oh, okay. As soon as Danny Mama get out here, you you all fucked! <laughs> oh, they did. They're both dead. They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Cut the generator off. Yeah, we're gonna finish you off just for the hell of it. Yeah, Andy was gone. Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, they were. Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Ah. <sighs> How are you doing? <clears throat> right, look, doing I'll good. be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? I'm with you. I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready to roll. I want you to come with us. I mean it. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Uh, yes. Well, I'm gonna say I'm sorry you saw them. I'm sorry you had to see that, but I only did it to protect us. Because they tried to hurt us? Yes. Okay. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers.
Hopefully it's not the ambush. They don't shoot, we're here to help. Don't shoot, we're here to help! Hey, Silent Shade, thanks for stopping by. How's your day going? Figures. Oh, crap. Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. That's what's up. Hey, thanks, Darkling. I was just gonna get to that. all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, we finna take that shit. It? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? We have to take this, Clementine. We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. Who says it's your decision to make? Hey, we don't have time for this shit. Like it or not, we need this food. Now get over here and open the trunk, Lee. Yeah, just boss me around. I don't feel comfortable with her having a gun in her hand. I mean, we did just kill her dead. It's locked. No shit, I already tried that. But I heard you take the keys from up front. Like I couldn't just reach through the window. More food in here. Supplies? I'll take it. Great. Maybe we'll survive this after all. Duck, why don't you carry this? Okay. Got a box of food here. I'll carry it. This hoodie looks to be about your size. Why don't you hold on to this? It might get cold. It's not mine. It's yours it's now. It's yours now. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Oh, shit. What's going on? Sweetheart, we won't let them bandits get you, will we? No. Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Do you really need it? My dad gave it to me for my birthday. I promise. If you're I'll thinking find it, you're I'll safe, you know. sitting there acting like things are the way they used to be. The dead don't kill their own. It's the living you got to be afraid of. The people I used to call friends. People who took. Don't worry, little girl. Bandits got their eye on that dairy. As long as they keep getting food from them, you'll be safe. I promise. Oh, I guess.
guess that concludes the episode. Making is done, pal. Ain't nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking Thanks, about Super the farm last night. Not much phases. It's starting to add up. I'm gonna raid that when it's over. The coast. Get him out of all this. I got seasons all online. Lily's not doing so good, huh? But we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Episode 3. I'll be streaming this on Wednesday. Oops. Well, I guess these are the credits. Let me go ahead and see who's online so I can read out. Okay, my boy's online, Ninja Wolf, okay. start this raid. I'm going to end the stream.